do pro athletes get paid too much? So a few days ago, Stephen Curry announced that he signed a five-year, two hundred million dollar deal with the Golden State Warriors. And I don't watch TV, but I imagine that the fucking motherfuckers on MSNBC and so on are probably arguing how athletes are making too much money. But actually, so LeBron tweeted that this 200 million is not enough, and he's right. Uh, according to LeBron, like before Curry joined the team, the team was worth half a billion, and now it's worth two and a half billion. So he added two billion of value to the team, but he's only going to be paid 0 0.2 billion. So he's going to be paid one tenth of the value he added to the team. Now, why is that? Well, it as it turns out, there are actual salary caps in NBA. It's about 95 million. In case of Curry, it seems he's getting less even than the cap, but look, why would there be a cap on the salary? Well, according to Wikipedia, Wikipedia, the cap is to basically protect the team from mm, the business getting too expensive. In other words, translated into English, the purpose of the cap is so that the Jewish owner of the team makes the money and not the black players. And now they go on the uh, Diamond CNBC is going to tell you that, well, this is very unfair that the players get paid too much. Like, why should the black pay players be getting paid so much? Instead, let's let the Jewish owner of the team make all the profit. I mean, it's not like MSNBC or whatever are advocating that the tickets to the game should be cheaper. Like, let's say if the tickets are $5,000, for example, obviously the cost of the ticket depends on the game, depends on the how close it is to the court, whatever, but let's say the ticket costs $5,000. Is your liberal propagandist advocating that the ticket should be reduced in price from $5,000 to $50? No. They're just advocating that the player gets paid less. So they want the, you know, the business, the team, to collect as much money as before, but all the money should go to the owner of the team not, and not to the player. So let's limit, you know, let's limit the salary of the players who are breaking their legs. And, you know, after five years, they're going to be bankrupt anyway because they will have spent all, all their money and they're not going to have any source of income <laughs> because they're stupid. So let's punish the guys who are going to be bankrupt in five years. And let's have more money go to the owner of the team who was already rich and will be richer every year for the next fucking hundred years. Let's protect that guy. And the fucking idiot liberals are of course, yes, yes, the players are getting paid too much. I mean, use your fucking head. Like, is somebody saying that the money that's taking away from the players is going to go to like single mothers or something? No. <laughs> that's the problem with communism is that the, the communism is always about punishing the guys in the middle, the middle class, the ones that create all the value and taking the money and giving it to the super rich, to the Jews, right? <laughs> the money never goes to the poor. Look at North Korea. Look how great the poor are doing in communism. Anyway. <sighs> That's the beauty of controlling the, the media, as the Jews do. And having a dumb fucking population which can think for themselves, as Brzezinski said, that uh, the purpose of the media will be in the future to think for the people who will demand that the media give them their conclusion. And that's how it works. So you control the media, and the media tells the people that the middle class makes too much, and all, you should get all the money. Of course, you don't say it that way. You just point it at the middle class and say they make too much and uh, the poor immediately agree but the problem is that the poor don't understand that what you take away from the middle class is not going to go to the poor it's going to go to you so i understand that uh, nba players who make who have 200 million dollar contracts are not exactly middle class but ultimately they are being exploited by the owner of the team <laughs> and their Salary is already limited arbitrarily just so that the owner can make more money. And what 
the liberals are proposing is limited even more so that the owner can make more money still. And it's not like the money is going to go to somebody who actually needs it. Anyway, thanks.